Hi everybody, so trying to get out of away from the whiteboard and into real life a little bit with this example. We're in the basement of a house. This is a sewer pipe. Okay. Um, this drains to the sewer. So it can't be flat. The slope must cannot be zero because we want it to drain. It's got a slope. You might assume that you need the steepest slope possible to get that stuff out of your house as fast as you can, right? Well, that won't work. It cannot be too steep. If it's too steep, the liquids will go faster than the solids. The solids can then kind of uh, accumulate and clog up your pipe, all right? If it's too shallow, if it doesn't slope enough, or it's too flat, let's say if it's too flat, then um, obviously it won't drain well either. So this pipe says three inches. And if I check the diameter with the ruler, I find the diameter is three inches, okay? So for three inch diameter pipes, they say that you need a slope of about um, a drop of one eighth of an inch for every one foot of horizontal distance, okay? So how do you measure that? So I'm going to try to measure the slope of this sewer pipe to see if it's up to standard. Um, so I got a spurt level, right? Now the spurt level has a bubble in the middle of it. If this is not flat, the bubble will go to either side. When the bubble is in between the two lines right there, that's how we know we have a perfectly flat horizontal line, okay? So I'm going to keep this flat, and then I'm going to try to measure, uh, compare that to the pipe, and then uh, find out what the drop is. Now, this spurt level is actually two feet, which I prefer to use rather than one feet. Um, makes the measurement easier. So for every one foot, remember, we need a, a drop of about an eighth of an inch, right about an eighth of an inch. So if it's two feet, the drop should be how much? So two feet across, the drop should be two eighths of an inch, and two eighths is one quarter of an inch, all right? Here's our ruler. We've got inches, and so you can see the one for one inch here, and there's a half inch, and in between the half and the end is your quarter inch. So I'm looking at that quarter inch mark, and you can see how close we get. So we're going to keep the spurt level flat like that, where the bubble is right in between the two lines. And then we're going to measure from the very bottom of the pipe, not like the side or like the very center bottom of that pipe and see what the drop is. Okay. Let me see if I can show you that. Um, my bubble right in between the two lines, measure from the center of the pipe down, and that's right around a quarter of an inch, so that looks good, All right? So we have a two foot run and a quarter inch, whoops, ah. we have a two foot run and a quarter inch um, drop here, okay? And so that's the perfect slope for this sewer line. Quarter inch drop for every two foot uh, run. 